One of the most common complications in neurological patients is shoulder subluxation. Let's see how to manage shoulder pain and subluxation in stroke patients. Hemiplegic shoulder pain is one of the commonest complications that is seen in post-stroke patients and its occurrence ranges between 17 to 64 percent within the first three weeks from the onset of hemiplegia. So let's first quickly discuss what actually happens in a hemiplegic shoulder that makes it more susceptible for shoulder subluxation and pain. Now during the flaccid phase, the glenohumeral integrity is significantly compromised. The muscles that were responsible to provide the shoulder support and counteract the inferior pull of the gravity are not functioning properly. This results in the inferior and anterior migration of the humeral head which we can acknowledge by the presence of the sulcus sign. Also, as a result, there is abnormal stretching in the periarticular structures which undergo the ischemic changes resulting in the pain and inflammation. Some of the evidence-based techniques to manage this condition includes modified exercise techniques for shoulder, the NMES stimulation for shoulder pain, kinesio taping method, and the right shoulder support for weak shoulder. Let's see how to apply these techniques for a hemiplegic shoulder. These are the examples of the indirect shoulder mobilization exercises, which utilizes the trunk movements to mobilize the shoulder. This is a wonderful way to exercise an already subluxated shoulder. You can watch the full video we made on this. The link is provided in description. Now, the best way to manage the shoulder pain that develops in the affected shoulder is the NMES. It's a part of electrical muscle stimulation and has high evidence in managing shoulder pain. Kinesio taping is another innovative approach that can be used in the affected shoulder to get many benefits like stabilization, proprioception, pain relief, etc. To watch full technique on how to apply this tape, link is provided in description. There are many variety of shoulder splints and supports available, but choosing the one which stabilizes it real good is important. Link to the best shoulder support and stroke is given in description. To watch this treatment in detail, watch the Brunstrom playlist only on Physio Classroom channel. Check the link in description. Thanks for watching.